Hello and welcome to Powerhouse Ministry. Today we're going to talk about restoring broken relationships. Matthew 5 9 says, Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called the children of God. We are all members of God's family, and as members of God's family, we all need to know how to restore broken fellowship when things of that nature occur. Unfortunately, most of us were never taught how to resolve conflicts. God himself specializes on the subject matter of restoring relationships. Unfortunately, we, his children, have no clue on how to restore our relationships. Today we're going to discuss a few biblical steps that will help us all in the process of restoring fellowship and or restoring relationships. Initially, it is important that we talk to God before we talk to the person. Equally as important, we should always take the initiative. It doesn't matter whether you are the offender or the offended. God always expects us to take the initiative and or to make the first move. It is also wise to sympathize with other people's feelings. If you really want to restore a relationship, it's just wise to use your ears more than you use your mouth. Before attempting to solve any type of disagreement, you must be willing to listen first and listen to another person's feelings. In the process, make sure that you confess your part of the conflict, whatever it may be. It's just good to accept responsibility for your mistakes and to ask for forgiveness. You don't have to make excuses or shift the blame. Just honestly own up to any part that you have played in the conflict. Try to remember to address or attack the problem, but not the person. Put forth every effort to cooperate with the other person as much as possible. And finally, put more emphasis on reconciliation, which focuses primarily on your relationship. Always emphasize reconciliation more than resolution. Romans 12, 18 says, Do everything possible on your part to live in peace with everybody. Conclusively, we can reestablish a relationship even when we are unable to resolve our differences.